Hi guys, Archie Luxury, and who do I recommend in America? In America, who do I recommend for quality pre-owned wristwatches? David SW, David SW, David SW. Go to davidsw.com. He is the best, the greatest pre-owned dealer in all of the United States of America. David SW, David SW, David SW. <laughs> Hey guys, Archie Luxury on the Paul Pluto channel doing paid review 21QB112. Dear sir, quick wristwatch check. I'm wearing the Submarina 41mm in tribute to Blue Shirt Buddha. 41mm date. Love this watch. Dear sir, love, love, and Viking love your channel. I know that you don't do shite for free, so I've PayPal'd 120 US so that you can tell me what an idiot I am. I have always loved and appreciated fine, complicated watches that are somewhat unusual. Unfortunately, I am not as smart and enterprising as I wish I was and cannot afford to collect paddocks and vacherons yet. I managed to acquire a few pieces that I love and that I hope aren't dog shite laugh out loud. My everyday is a Chopard chronometer on NATO strap. I also own a blank pane Villaret chrono chronometer, 77 out of 100 I was told possibly. El Primero Concorde cause Zenith was too expensive sadly and yes, a King Seiko chrono chronometer to want to get a snowflake soon. All I ask is you tell me what you don't like and why in your brutal, honest review. Definitely will support you on Patreon as I never want to be an asshole that sends you 20 bucks to review a 100,000 paddock. I pray that one day that bubble bursts and I will have the opportunity to acquire my... Dream 5107 for under 20,000. Best regards, David. P.S. Please call me Biker in the review. You are awesome, Sir Archie. Photos attached. And I got to be honest with you. I had a look at this review and I just remember. I, You know what? I got constipated. I did this review constipated. I said, oh no, he sent me a good donation. Oh my god, he's got a Concorde. What disaster. Then he's got a, a Chopard and a blank pane, Villarette. I gotta tell you, I'm so tired of this garbage. Where do you get this crap from? Seriously, where do you get this garbage from? Man, what can I say? There are some people who should not collect watches. And man, how could this have happened? Tell me this. How could this happen? What do we got here? The worst thing you've got, Concord. It's Garbage. Absolute garbage. We've got a King, Sen King Seiko chronometer. Viking hell. Viking hell. We've got a show pad. It looks really worn and used. And then a blank pane. Villaret chronometer. My God. This is... i got to be totally honest with you. It's crap. There's nothing here I like. Man, I, if you just had a Tudor Black Bay, a simple Tudor Black Bay, that would be so much better. I don't know what you were thinking. Tell me you bought these pre -owned. I don't know what to say. The show part, my God. 
That is toxic sludge. Toxic sludge. Toxic sludge. And you've got the blank pain villarette. My God, does somebody actually buy that stuff? Man. You didn't buy this new, did you? These were just... You bought these because they were cheap. And this is always the danger. Somebody buys something cheap. They want things cheap. Man. And the King Seiko. Mary, just, let me just have a look at this here. Let me just call this up. Because I, I can't believe you honestly bought this stuff. The Seiko? What's the Seiko like? Uh, I gotta be honest with you, the Seiko, these were expensive. You know that? The King Seikos were pretty good. The Blank Pain, man, what the hell happened here? It's got some really nasty divots and dings in it, man. What the hell happened? Can I ask you that? Why is it so badly damaged? I don't like it. Man, why does it, why is it on, I don't know, is this bracelet original? What the hell is this thing? Please tell me that. Can you tell me that? Is this original? It can't be. You bought them cheap, didn't you? Ah, the, oh, the Concord man. That's an ugly, 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 fugly watch, man. The show part. What the hell were they doing with the bezel? Were they using it to? I don't understand this. This is really nasty. What happened to the original? strap on this. I don't understand this stuff. I don't understand what the hell has gone wrong. Please tell me what has gone. Tell me what's gone wrong. Why do you have these watches here? They're just garbage. It's garbage, man. I mean, there's some semi-brands there. Chopard. I like the Millie Migler, you know, with the racing tire strap but show part then we've got the blank pain villarette i didn't know anyone bought that stuff you know what i mean i think that's the first villarette i've reviewed on the channel this is what happens when you look for brand bang per buck you look for a big brand name for cheap money you end up getting these sort of garbagey pieces. I'm sorry. I love you. I thank you for supporting me. But these are Viking ugly, horrid watches. Even the King Seiko looks old and beaten. What happened, man? Where did you, in, your, in the life's journey, where did you take the wrong path? What went wrong? I love your enthusiasm. I love it. I love it to death. But man, why did you do this? Why? Please tell me why. This is fucking garbage. I mean, the uh, Chopard's a good brand. Blank pain. Cor Concord is garbage. King Seiko, okay, but man, what were you thinking? Instead of trying to get cheap bang per buckers, just get one decent watch. One beautiful, decent watch. Don't humiliate yourself like this. It's like somebody who's got to have a Mercedes. They want a Mercedes. They end up driving an old beaten up 190E. That's not cool. When they say a Mercedes, they're talking about an SL, AMG, something like that, or a C65. They're not talking about a 190E 
from the 80s. That's not what they're talking about. And if it is from the 80s, it's the, you've probably got the poverty version, not the 2.2 2 point, 2 point, 2 point, 2 point 2.6 liter is the screamer. 2.6 liter. Man, I don't know what to say. Please don't get upset. But man, why do you buy this garbage? That's not a watch collection. That's killing time. Life's too short to wear garbage. Life is too short to wear garbage. Garbage is never cool. Nothing cool in this collection. I'm sorry, man. I wanted to say something positive. I wanted to be nice, but I just can't do it. I'm sorry. This is a Viking mess. It's a Viking mess. There's nothing I like. And why don't they have the original? Why have you put these? I, I don't understand. Because they were cheap, Mr. Chesterfield. They were a bargain buy. The discount bin is where these came from. They came out of the discount bin. Guys, like, subscribe and tell your friends. Guys, I love you all. Please get a paid review. I can't survive on Google Ads. Can't survive on Google Ads. Help us out, guys. I'd really appreciate it. It means the world to me. Okay, guys, I will see you in the next one. Don't forget, you can also sponsor me on Patreon. Patreon allows you to pay as little as a dollar a month, and it keeps me full-time on YouTube. Hey guys, check out my one of my best friends, Jamie Opulence on YouTube. Just go to Jamie Opulence on YouTube. A fantastic travel, a fantastic channel from my good friend, Jamie. Check it out, guys. Hey guys, Archie Luxury. Guys, I want to introduce a new service to you. ValueYourWatch.com. Proud supporters of Archie Luxury. No seller's fees, no buyer's fees. That's right, guys. This is a trading platform to buy or sell watches. You can start selling for free. That's right. Uh, we advertise our paying for, for our paying sub subscribers on Google, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn. It's a global platform. That's right, guys. Get $50 off the annual subscription by applying the coupon Archie when you check in there. But, guys, you can try this for free straight away. Guys, you can start listing watches. ValueYourWatch.com. Give it a try and tell me what you guys think of that. Just wanna be a mini me. Are these neck just wanna be a mini me? Are these neck neck just wanna be a mini me? Are these neck neck just wanna be a mini me? Are these neck neck just wanna be a mini me? Like, subscribe, and tell your friends, and don't be afraid to get a paid review. 50 US dollars for a paid review. It helps me stay full time on YouTube, and I will see you in the next one. 50 US dollars paid review. I can't survive on Google Ads. I need your support. And guys, you could also sponsor me on Patreon. Patreon allows you to pay as little as a dollar a month to keep me on YouTube. Hey guys, Archie Luxury, who do I recommend for watches in Brisbane and Sydney? Vintage Watch Co, that's correct. Vintage Watch Co in Brisbane Arcade in Brisbane and the Strand Arcade in Sydney. Vintage Watch Co, Brisbane and Sydney. Ronnie, 
I've known him since the late 90s. Ronnie is a top bloke. Luke is a great guy. Vintage Watch Co. That is who I recommend in Australia. Check out Vintage Watch Co. and the guys' amazing range of watches. They also do service and repairs. Vintage Watch Co. That is where the pontiff goes. You know, some of my paddocks came from Vintage Watch Co. That's right, guys. Vintage Watch Co.